Hey guys, this is the Argent Defender and I'm here today to bring you episode 3 of The Wolf Among Us, A Crooked Mile. So, without further ado, let's get started. Our stories used to be so simple. We had a beginning, a middle, and an end. But ever since we moved to this awful city, everything's gotten so confused. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. Snow. I just want you to be careful. I almost lost you once and... I'm not yours to lose. I'm not going to be an errand girl for Crane anymore. She looks like Holly. It's not Holly, it's her sister Lily. She was looking to pay down debt. Eventually, the only people she owed were at her work. You know, that shithole club, the pudding and pie. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. The open arms. Oh my god! What is it? <gasps> it's... Crane. Damn, shit's going down. That fucking creep. Spineless little fucking rat. Crane? Ugh. God, you think you'd know a person. Bigby, you have to tell her. I know! What's going on? What did you find up there? You know, other than the... I just need to find Snow. Why? What's going on? Shit! Crane's been... Ugh. Oh, Bigby, calm down. Everything's going to be fine, okay? It's going to be fine. Will someone please explain this to me? Crane has been stalking Snow White. I have to tell Snow what's going on right now. Okay, it's, it's going to be okay. Where did you see her last? Did she say where she was going? She took Holly to the business office to prepare for the funeral. Lily's funeral? Yeah. How do you know? I was just at the trip trap, and I heard Gren telling some folks about a funeral at the Buckingham the Bridge. Trip trap? Are you drinking? When? Right now. They were on their way out. Looks like we're off to a funeral. Bigby! Wait. What? Snow's... Snow's been through a lot. There are things she doesn't talk about. Just... Please be careful when you tell her. And you should tell her. But... I know. No, you don't know. You know how you felt when you saw that picture? Well, it's going to be much worse for her. Just remember that. I don't know how you could break it to her nicely. Oh damn, uh, frame rate, low. The rain is making the frame rate drop a ton. Oh well. part of a very special circle. People she trusted and cared for. I won't, um, offend you by claiming one day that... that the pain of losing Lily will ever subside. I know as well as you that it will never subside. Oh, Lawrence. But I also know that... that the memory... I was wondering where it was. ...will sustain Your Highness. Life. Oh, uh, Sheriff. I'm sorry, I, uh, I didn't see you there. I hold not. About as well as you think. I haven't had any other, um, it's never been as bad as when you saw me at least. I was angry at first, 
when I heard that Lily was getting a funeral. Holly was getting closure. I wanted that too. And I wanted it for Faith. But then I remembered Faith lived a story Lily never did. She had her adventure. She got to live in the light of forever after Lily. For a while. So let Lily have the better finish. It all evened out. In the end. I'm sorry, Lawrence. I know, Sheriff. And thanks for saving my life. Take care of things, okay? Thank you. I'll miss worrying about you. I'll miss our fights. I'll miss you. Holly. Bigby, is everything okay? No, not you. Holly, it's... He wasn't fucking invited. Holly, wait. He has no right to be here. Not after what he did. Holly, I'm sorry, but I had to come. You throw my sister down the witching well, and you have the nerve to show your face here? After you lie? After you promise me? Holly, wait. That was Crane. Just Crane. He disposed of Lily's body before Big B could do anything about it. I'm telling you the truth. Don't cover for him. But this genuinely wasn't his fault. You can't tell me Big B gives a shit about this. Holly, it's gonna be okay. I'm sorry, Holly. I, I didn't know he put her down the witching well. Big B cares, Holly. He's trying to help. And I'm sure he has a very good reason for being here. But this one isn't on him. Why are you here anyway? And don't say it's because you care about this. Everything okay? I just came to pay my respects, Holly. I don't mean any harm. Oh, really? You have no respect you can pay. You don't care about any of us. That's a bit unfair. Okay, okay, look. Bigby and I are going to have a little chat far away from the ceremony, all right? Look, Holly, I know how this must No, feel. you don't know how this must feel. You have no idea. Don't fuck anything up. Don't bother anybody. And when the first sign of trouble comes, and it will come because you're a goddamn walking trap for it, I want you the fuck out of here. You hear me? I just want to get Lily's killer, Holly. Nothing more. Let's just continue, okay? This is such total fucking bullshit. Let's go, Holly. It's your turn to talk. I know you didn't come here to pay your respects, so whatever it is better be wildly important. It's been hard enough making a connection with these people when you pull this kind of stuff, it just resets the clock. Lily was Crane's prostitute. I followed a lead to this shithole motel, the Open Arms. Crane had a room there, and he's been taking prostitutes, or at the very least Lily, and making her look like you while he was, you know. This is... I don't even know what to say right now. I really don't. I'm just trying everything I can right now to not picture it, to not picture him. I'm sorry, Snow. And I'm sorry I had to be the one to tell you. You're sure this is what happened? This is what he's been doing? Because please, Bigby, don't confuse things. Yeah, Deposing don't show the first. Just tell her that you And if we get them. this wrong, it would mean more than our jobs. We'd get kicked out of Fabletown for messing all of this up so badly. Crane has been taking photos, Snow. Lots of photos. Photos that show him... He's been recording his visits with Lily. God. Look, let's go back to the business office. I doubt Crane's there at this hour, but we need to talk. And this isn't the place. Snow? Nerissa? What is it? I'm sorry, but Holly's asking for you. Are they starting the burn? Yes. Everyone who spoke should really be present for this part. 
She's kind of distraught. You're not leaving yet, are you? Two minutes. I don't mean to be, um... No, I understand. It's just that something's come up. No, I get it. Take your time. It won't take long. How'd it go? At the motel? Did you find anything? No? Yeah. Lily was killed there. It was an awful mess. Oh. I'm sorry. Nerissa! Yeah, um... Coming! Should I have told her that? I don't know. Constable? Wait, 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 easy oh, now. fuck girl. off. You know how this goes. The first thing in a visit, you say, how do you do? How do you do? That way, it's proper. Now is really not the time for whatever you Jergovs are planning to do. Well, isn't that the thing of it? Plans. Except it isn't our plans you should be concerning yourself with. We'll snip to the chase for all sakes. A little bird told us that you're fitting to go after Crane. And you see, we have an interest in that particular boy. So you leave Crane alone, and we'll leave you alone. Just take a little vacation is all. Don't even have to go anywhere. Just sit in your office and whistle to heaven for a few short days. You're trying to pull this shit at a funeral? We can deal with this later. No, not later. Later's too late. Right now. So what's it gonna be? We have a deal? You leave Crane alone and we leave you to yours? Brother? Speak your mind, fastly now. Just don't hurt anyone, D. That don't sound like a yes to me. Always wanting to do things the fun way. Ladies, gentlemen, invertebrates, please, rest easy. This is not... What the hell is going on? What's happening? Very sorry to impose, but we only had a deal to work out with Bigby. And we're unhappy to report that things did not go as smoothly as planned. Bigby, what is he talking about? Never you mind that, it ain't any of your... What deal? No deals. Settle down, settle down now. Yeah, everyone just stay where you are, nice and natural. I'm not making any deal with you, so just get the fuck out of here and leave these people alone. Nah. Uh -oh. What did I tell you? What did I say? Ali? Think you motherfuckers could come here uninvited? You think you could just fucking interrupt Lily's funeral? Calm down, darling. It's just a simple business transaction. You fucking freaks are not getting away with this. Polly, don't move. Yeah, listen to your lady love. Polly, let me handle this. Yeah, let's spare all the fuss. It's just a dead hole. I'm gonna kill you! <laughs> Grab the gun, grab the gun. Oh shit. Did they shoot him in the head? That looked like a headshot. Oh no. Shoulder. Okay. Is she dead? Is she dead? She looks very concerned. 